Any organization must have a way for organizing and controlling its documented information. When we speak of documented information, we mean any information important enough to be controlled and maintained by the organization in some documented form. Most commonly, documented information is just referred to as documents and records, or as documentation generally. Documentation is generally intended to include or imply documents such as manuals, procedures, and work instructions, as well as all kinds of records, such as production records, quality records, and so forth. Most commonly, this includes important communications as well, records, work instructions, procedures, manuals, as I said before, but it should include any other information important enough to warrant control and documentation, including, for example, training materials or external documents used in your operations, such as industry standards or benchmarks. It means to store information in any retrievable form, such as by paper, magnetic, electronic, photographic, or any other means. Even software code, electronic forms, internet sites, and automated processes can be considered documented information. To control and maintain documented information generally means that you have a plan for the creation, naming, and formatting of documentation, the review and approval of documentation, access, storage, and protection of documentation, protecting the confidentiality of certain information, the distribution of documentation, the revision of documentation, and finally, for the retention and disposition of documentation. An auditor will apply certain loose criteria in assessing your document management system, such as, is it appropriate or is it adequate for your circumstances? For example, are documents appropriately named so as to avoid confusion and to afford quick identification and access? Or, are the permission controls adequate to prevent malicious tampering or the destruction of records? Let's go through each one of the control points and discuss what you should consider when planning how to control and maintain your documents.